we always love doing the unexpected with Scott Lang. Ant-Man is arguably the character that is the most underestimated. Ant-Man became the key to saving the universe in Avengers Endgame. So carrying that tradition, we thought, well, let's use this film to kick off phase five. It's been almost a decade now that I've been playing this part. I've loved it and I feel protective of Scott Lang and Ant-Man. It's really nice coming back. I still kind of can't believe that I'm sitting there and it's like, wow, there's Michelle Pfeiffer and there's Michael Douglas. I just saved eight bucks. God, I admire you. It's really nice not to get used to working with legends. You're sending a signal down to the quantum realm. The secret universe beneath ours. Janet has been very quiet about her time in the quantum realm. Maybe would have you know, made different choices. <laughs> There's someone I never told you about. This place isn't what you think. Kang, the Conqueror, is terrifying. And if there ever was a maniac loose in the quantum realm, it's him. Playing Kang, the Conqueror, is such a gift. Your reality. Everything you're holding on to, I know how it ends. This is the beginning, and he cannot be contained. Something like this, which is so transportive and visually striking, people should really see it in a movie theater. You want it to be as big and as visceral and consuming as possible. Audiences are going to watch this and go, I can't believe this is happening going to be bonkers it's like we're camping we've never been camping but we've always talked about it